When the gang gets hungry, there's only one place to go. The old original Lone Star Steakhouse. Four adults can dig into 40 ounces of delicious and tender sirloin tidbits all the What's up guys, my name is Jake, and welcome to this abandoned Lone Star Steakhouse in the Northeast United States. I believe a creator friend of mine had made a video on this a couple years back, but the boys and I had literally just come across this randomly. So let's take a look inside this once thriving restaurant. Hello? Hello? We're just taking some pictures. Some fake cactuses. The fake cacti. secure alarm, is it? The waiting area. The roof is completely collapsing down. Wow. Now, because it's such a small place, obviously there isn't a ton of information on it, but from what I could figure out, this particular Lone Star Steakhouse was built in around 1995 and, or 1996 and had closed in 2005 to around 2008. 2008 was actually the first time when it was published online uh, as for sale, and since then obviously no one has bought it, and it's been abandoned in the state for quite some time. Most of the tables are actually still here, but they've, uh, well, they're having some problems. Man, look at the ceiling. Yeesh. I'm not sure what happened here. I can't tell if this was vandals or if... Maybe. Though it, it does look like things just started collapsing from weight. And I'm not sure. It's crazy though. The whole ceiling on this side is completely exposed. <clears throat> ceiling tiles everywhere. Now the reason for closing uh, I believe is because the location had just moved down the street, actually, into their new renovated, uh, well, not renovated, a brand new facility with a more um, refined brand image. A brand image that you would find in a current Lone Star Steakhouse, but this one is sort of a, a peek into the past, not only to see what Lone Star used to look like, in the United States um, and in Australia, but what a Lone Star Steakhouse looks like when it's been abandoned for over 10 years, over a decade. Huh, look at these. Huh. These are actually pretty cool. Look at these. I love these murals here. 
Huh. Of course, the bar area. Kind of stripped. Lone Star. Obviously, the condition of this building is never going to get better. And honestly, in my opinion at least, the land is probably more valuable than the structure itself. Well, it almost definitely is, considering the area that it's in is pretty much booming right now. So I don't really expect this relic of restaurant past <laughs> to be around much yeah. longer. Jeez. We're venturing into the kitchen now. Through treacherous means. Yeah. Some of the stuff's still here. Yeah, you can see people opened it up, though, and yeah. snipped a lot of the stuff. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Looking for it could have been the restaurant that did that, though. Wiring, yeah, maybe they salvaged some stuff. But yeah. see this? This was copper themes. You think? Well, that's copper oh, uh, yeah. uh, lead right yeah, there. Yeah, you're right. Hmm. You can see, too, they were probably going for coils in the... Uh, yeah. Okay, uh, if that's the case, they left a lot behind then. Yeah, there's still a lot left here. What was this? Cold storage? Um, must have been, right? Yeah, probably There's a thermometer in it, so it must have been. Yeah, oh yeah, for sure. It was like a, like a fridge. Yeah. Uh, I know that all too well. <laughs> the only job I ever had was a dishwasher in a restaurant. We use the exact same thing. Well, you moved up, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> we moved up into going to abandoned restaurants. Yeah. What'd you say? I'll take that any day. Yeah. <laughs> we have a weird, weird taste for things, Brennan. We're not normal people. <laughs> oh, I don't want to rub against these, this equipment. Ugh. Wow. Man, I can't believe these left, they left these behind. I know, there's so much. And there's just holes in the roof up there. You can see where uh, light's coming in. So this building is... Uh, it's on the downward path for sure. Oh yeah. If you couldn't tell by the collapsed roof yet. Well, I mean, a couple good rains and this whole thing will be destroyed. Oh, I know. A couple snow, a couple winters. Yeah. Hmm. Freezer in there. This stove. Ugh. Rusted shut with like God. a recent. Oh. Oh my. Jeez. Look at that. Huh. They probably would have heated meals and then. Yeah, the, it was heat. probably, um. Yeah, it's probably where they, uh, would put meals to keep them warm. Yeah. And even cook, look at that, up to some pretty high temperatures. Oh, maybe, yeah. And yeah, maybe it's just a large oven. These are all fridges here. I'm terrified to open them. That might be your department, Brent. <laughs> you want me to open them? You want to open them? Oh, God. This is not going to be good. Please don't be smelly. Oh, my. <coughs> oh. <laughs> Jeez. That was like powdered milk. Yeah, that's not. Uh... That was. Oh, God. Okay. I'm being very protective with a mask. Because it's so bad in there. Oh, man. There's actually quite a bit of stuff on the other side, too. This is horrifying. Can you imagine being in here at night? Or just like waking up in here? Oh. Look at this. Oh, that's like our whole liquor cabinet right there. Holy shit. Wow. Canadian club. Oh my god, look at the mildew on these. That's insane. Irish cream. Hmm. Jesus Christ, man. Ugh. 
This is what happens when you leave bottles of liquor in an abandoned Lone Star. Jesus Christ. Oh, man. Ew, it's... Oh, it's all wet. I don't want to hold this for too long. <laughs> you got your shot? Yeah, you're good. <laughs> There's old uniforms in there, too. Ugh. That's the outside. Cleaning. Oh, God, Brennan. Yeah. Oh. I can smell it from here. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's really bad. Thank God I have my respirator on, otherwise, I, would, I literally would be dying. This is just brand new bottles of stuff. Oh, that is a horrible sight. Whew. Look at the canned tomato juice. Still in their packages. Hold on, one box says ice cream. Where? It's the middle shelf. See right there on the box? It's like oh, this is a, oh God. Oh no. That is horrible. And then these cartons down here. Island Oasis. Lemonade. <laughs> that is disgusting, the pooling <laughs> liquid. <laughs> All right, get me out of here. Jeez, that's crazy. Some more stock. Oh, so who faxes? this? There's a Longhorn, or a Lone Star. Oh, they have banner. They uh, probably banner. Have, probably had that in the main restaurant. Oh, this is um. Look at all the sun on all this stuff. Yeah. Just dust. This is where they would have um put their the juice syrup for like the fountain drinks. Oh no! Can, oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah! Look at here's one of them still left. Yeah, that's a Coca Cola. Huh. And then root back is up there. Wow. All right, Brennan. I've lost my appetite. <laughs> I no longer want to eat. At the Lone Star. At the Lone Star. Let's get out of here. I am with you on that one, Plus, Lone Star Steakhouse has six lunch specials under $4. Dinner starting at $5.25. So when your gang gets hungry, bring them to the Lone Star Steakhouse. A family tradition since 1966. We'll be waiting for you.